Hey everybody, it's Colette with Blessings Craft Therapy with another project. Friends, let's make a pretty sign out of this Christmas tray and a calendar from Dollar Tree. Oh, fun. All right, so I'm using these um, mailing labels from Staples, but they block out any text. So I'm just making um, a pattern with them and I'm cutting two. So they weren't big enough for one full one. So I had to do two halves and you saw how I did that um, template. And all I'm doing now is putting it on the tray. These trays I got at Dollar General. They were on sale after Christmas for 90% off and um, they were a dollar full price. So 90% off. I got the tray for 10 cents. <laughs> so fun. Anyways, I digress. I am just showing you here how I put that mailing label on and see you can't see the writing underneath. It's so cool. Um, and again, I did two of them. All right, next we have, this is a page from a Dollar Tree calendar that I absolutely love. And I'm just kind of folding it or pressing it so that I can cut out all of the excess of the calendar so it fits in the, um, why are words so hard today? <laughs> Anyways, you know what I'm doing. I'm cutting it out so it fits inside the tray or the pan or whatever that thing is. There it is. All right. So the next, we're going to make sure it fits. Yup, it does. So then we're going to cover it. Now, if I do this, if I were to do this again, I would just cover the pan with the Mod Podge and then put the, um, the calendar piece on top. But for some reason today, I put the Mod Podge on the calendar piece it, it just didn't work as well as I would like. Um, and then here I am adhering it with a piece of cellophane on top so that I don't get any wrinkles. Um, again, if I were to do it again, it, I think I would get a better um, adhering if I used the uh, Mod Podge on the pan and then put that on. But anyways, all right. Because I had a couple wrinkles, I'm putting some Mod Podge on the top to seal it, but I'm using a dauber so it gives a really cool like texture. Now, I found this jute at Dollar Tree the other day in the nautical section, and I am there for it. It's so cool. It's like a stripey. Oh, I love it. So I took two long pieces of it, excuse me, three long pieces of it, and I'm braiding them. Um, I made the pieces long enough to go around the tray. Then I'm going to glue it onto the tray. It's just there's just a little bit of a, a space between where the calendar goes and the edge. Um, as you know, I cannot cut a straight line and apparently I can't cut a straight circle either wait <laughs> straight circle sorry I made myself laugh anyways so we're just going to glue this braided jew all the way around look at how fun and I'm going to say I think it looks good just like this like I could almost be done right there boom it's done but no it's not I gotta add a hanger which I'm using my crocodile and I just add a hanger same jute I'm using to make the hanger with perfect and then I made some felt flowers and I glued them on are you kidding look at how cool this looks oh I love it I love it so much this is the other one going down oh it's so much fun I love it friends I hope you'll try this because goodness gracious this made me filled with joy mm -hmm. 